G'day all, it's Colin from PCTLC and thanks for joining me. I just wanted to follow up on um, on the uh, disk partitioning side of things with this install here. So I'm not sure whether we have the partition available in here or not. Um, we have a 488 megabyte hard drive, but not the 100 and we have a basic partition there. No. So what I'm going to have to do is go into install KDE partition or G parted. I don't know if I've installed any of those. No. Let's go to software center. KDE partition. Okay, let's have a quick look at that. Partition Manager. Okay, so we have our 139 gigabyte drive there unallocated so that might be the drive we want to use to share so now it depends what we want to do with that we'll try and do NTFS because that's the best option if you're going to share with uh, Windows 10 anyway uh, we'll call it data it's our data partition NTFS, yep, okay. So, oh, I haven't applied yet, have I? Almost forgot to apply. So, all operations have successfully finished. Okay, this is not a bad partitioner anyway. I haven't used this one before. So we have, uh, what is it? SDA9. So let's see if that's available. Should show up as data. So there we go. Can we add create new folder? Yes, we can. I'll cancel that. Oh, actually, no. We'll um, create new folder. Call it share. Let's um, create a new text file. We'll call that share. Just to keep it simple. And um, so what I'm going to do is uh, stop this video. And I'm going to put this video inside the shared folder. And have a look in Windows 10. So let's do that. Okie doke, so we're in uh, Windows 10. So I'm just going to open up the file manager here in Windows 10. And we are going to look for, uh, go to this PC, and we have a data drive there. There's the share. And there's my video. So that's the video I just made regarding this. Uh, 
this scenario here. So um, there you go. So we have a dual boot situation with Windows 10 and KDE Neon and we're sharing an NTFS data drive. Now I'm not sure if all Linux shares NTFS. I'm sure they do, but I know there's an NTFS dash G or 3G or something. I can't remember if it doesn't work. So you could just Google that, I suppose. But in this scenario, it's working no problem at all. So that's uh, my follow-up video on the uh, dual booting of Windows 10 and KDE Neon. Thanks for watching.